Welcome to IT and Digital Resources in Teaching Foreign Languages, lecture number 24, Online Visualization Tools for Organizing Learning Activities and Assessing Student Achievement. Plan for today's lecture. Using the cluster method in the organization of learning activities, the method of mental maps, brainstorming, timeline maker, fishbone method, Venn diagram, SWOT analysis, chart, infographics. Clustering technique enables the students to make connection between new words and remaining words they have and they try to develop the core word with other related words. By looking at the vocabulary from the new viewpoint provided by the organizing nature of clustering technique, the learners can deepen their understanding and improve access to the vocabulary. Through clustering technique, the students are expected to be able to memorize and reproduce the words they have learned easier than by memorizing through a list of words, and they will be more interested in learning vocabulary so that their vocabulary skill will increase. In clustering technique, the students hold the main role on teaching learning process. The teacher just led the students. The students are actively involved in the teaching learning process. Clustering technique uses context clues that makes the students easier in learning vocabularies. Moreover, by using clustering technique, the student will also learn about the meaning of the words, the parts of the speech of the words and try to use them in sentences orally. Clustering technique, actually a pre-writing technique used in developing an idea in paragraph writing. Clustering is a type of free associated listening. According to Nation, cluster is words grouped around a central point when new words are met. They can be fitted into the most suitable place in the cluster, and this always provides good opportunity for revising related words. Therefore, clustering technique is the technique that can be used to improve access to the vocabulary, which means that the aim of this technique is at increasing the association that learners make with words by being encouraged to think of words of related meaning and make it in kind of bubble diagram. Besides that, Sinaga states that in clustering techniques, students have chance to show their ability to develop a certain knowledge given, connect it with other connected words and put in form of cluster. By using clustering technique, the students are actively involved in making a connection between context clues given an existing vocabulary they have in their mind, and then they have to make the whole words in a kind of bubble diagram, which showing the connection new word and remain words. Clustering technique seems to be important to find out the new words so that they can recall and remind the vocabulary that they have learned. By implementing clustering technique in learning vocabulary, students can develop their vocabulary by clustering them with linking word. Cluster is one of the widely used methods in teaching a foreign languages now. It can be used in all stages of teaching English to both young and age learners. In presenting new words, a teacher writes a new word on the blackboard, and then learners tell the words that can be used together with the given word. Then teacher gives a task to make up word combinations with the word book, for example, my book, a good book, an interesting book, a nice book, and etc. This method involves all the learners into active work and forms of motivation. It can be effectively used in improving monologue speech habits and skills. The method of mental maps, brainstorming. Brainstorming it is technique for generating new ideas on a topic. 
These methods stimulate creative activity of the learners in solving problems and express their ideas frankly. Various variants of solving the problem are usually given here. In brainstorming, quantity of utterances is important, but not the quality. Teachers should listen to all utterances and not to criticize them. Instead of this, he inspired the learners to give as many variants of solving the problem as he or she can. Lacks of criticism create favorable conditions for the learners to express their ideas freely, and these, of course, motivate them. At the end of brainstorming activity, all the expressed utterances are written and then analyzed. Mind mapping online. Bubble.us makes it easy to organize your ideas visually in a way that makes sense to you and others. Our editor is designed to help you stay on task and capture your thoughts quickly. Thousands of people use Bubble.us daily to take notes, brainstorm new ideas, collaborate, and present more effectively. Bubble.us lets you share your mind maps easily with people or on social media. Collaborate with friends or colleagues in real time in a classroom or a business meeting and see changes to the mind map immediately. Mind mapping is a tool for visualizing connections between ideas or pieces of information. Ideas are linked by lines, creating a web of relationships that are easy to understand at a glance. Kaku. Kaku's diverse library of templates and shapes provide the pieces you need to create flowcharts, wireframes, network diagrams, organizing charts, and more. You can also import images and screenshots with your own assets to refine your designs. The easy-to-use editor will have you putting together your first diagram in minutes. When you visualize your process, it's easier to understand, streamline, and communicate with others. Diagrams are a highly effective way of transforming what's in your head into an easily shareable idea. You can share your work with anyone, team members and clients alike, even if they don't have a Kaku account. Send an entire folder or a specific Kaku diagram using edit and view only links. The easy way to draw a diagram online. Glyphsys diagramming software was built by a pair of engineers who wanted all the ease of drawing diagrams on a whiteboard packed into one powerful app. If you need a flowchart maker for your business, a wireframing app for your design project, or a diagramming tool for a software engineering team, Glyphy has your back. Mind42. Mind42 is a free online mind mapping software. In short, Mind42 offers you a software that runs in your browser to create mind maps, a special form of a structured diagram to visual visually organize information. Use it to create to-do lists, brainstorm ideas, organize events, you, you name it. Mind42 is completely free and supported. Created mind maps are private by default. Optionally, share your mind maps with others.
Poplet for Education, helping students learn visually and creatively with greater attention. Poplet is so visual it can be utilized in any language. Poplet is currently being used in over 100 different languages. Pull your team together for a quick brainstorm without a ton of hassle. Just invite colleagues to your board and work together in real time. Spiderscribe is an online mind mapping and brainstorming tool. It lets you organize your ideas by connecting notes, files, calendar events, and etc. in free form maps. You can collaborate and share those maps online. A picture is worth a thousand words. With Spiderscribe, you can visualize your ideas by connecting various pieces of information together. Unlike other mind mapping applications, Spiderscribe allows you to create freestyle maps by connecting in any way. Spiderscribe.net is the easiest mind mapping app you might ever see. Spiderscribe maps can combine elements like text, images, files, calendar events, and geographical locations. More type of stencils it will be added in time. Stencils can be customized, change colors, resize, format, and etc. Create professional timelines roadmaps in minutes. Presedon is a lightweight timeline maker that helps you quickly create great looking timelines and project roadmaps. With our initiative web-based interface, numerous export options and more, you'll be able to build and share your timeline in no time at all. Presedon is an easy-to-use timeline creator that helps you make professional timelines to work projects, school projects, and everything in between. Make a timeline, tell a story. Time Toast timelines are a beautiful way to share the past or even the future. Delightful timelines is easy as toast. Take your narrative to the next level with, your, with our George's interactive timelines. Bring your story to life in a way that not only looks good but colors it with context. Why you should use a timeline? Engage with interactivity, animation, and beautiful design. Focus on what is most important and communicate key moments. And change comprehension by providing the context to fully understand the story. Experience history in a way that connects the dots and puts things in perspective. Stories are best when shared. With Time Toast, you can publish your timelines and share your story with the world or with just a few. You can even empt your timeline on your own website and change its colors to fit it seamlessly. TikToki Timeline Maker TikToki is an online timeline maker software for creating beautiful interactive timelines that you can share on the web. TikTok's free account lets you create a fully functional timeline that you can share with friends and colleagues. TikTok timelines are not only designed to inform viewers but also to be captivating multimedia experiences. In addition to text, you can include images, videos, and audio in a timeline, TikTok magically turning them into an interactive gallery. Fishbone method. A fishbone diagram is a visual way to look at cause and effect. It is a more structured approach than some other tools available for brainstorming causes of the problem. The problem or effect is displayed at the head of mouth of the fish. Possible contributing causes are listed on the smaller bones under various cause categories. A fishbone diagram can be helpful in identifying possible causes for a problem that might not otherwise be considered by directing the team to look at the categories and think of alternative causes.
Include team members who have personal knowledge of the processes and systems involved at the problem or event to be investigated. Then diagram maker. The simplest way to create then diagrams online. A Venn diagram uses overlapping in circles or other shapes to illustrate the logical relationships between two or more sets of items. Often they serve to graphically organize things, highlighting how the items are similar and different. Then diagrams, also called set diagrams or logic diagrams, are widely, widely used in mathematics, statistics, logic, teaching, linguistics, computer science and business. SWOT analysis. Design an effective SWOT analysis that will give you strategy and a head start. With then gauge, you can easily design an attractive and memorable SWOT analysis. Clear layouts help you organize your information, while helpful icons and other visuals let you effectively communicate your ideas and insights. A visually engaging SWOT analysis helps team members, executives and clients all understand the areas they need to focus on. You can design SWOT analysis on, to include in consulting reports, client presentations, internal audit reports, and more. Being able to quickly create a professional SWOT analysis is available to anyone in a marketing, consulting, or business development role. Let's speak about infographics. Easily. Easily is a simple infographic maker that lets you visualize any kind of information. Visually, a new way to think about content creation. PictoChart.com. Easily create engaging and professional content in any format. Canva.com. Create a design. Infogram.com. Create engaging infographics and reports in minutes. Infogram is an interactive visualization tool that empowers people and teams to create beautiful content. Clustering can be used to facilitate sharing of information, to seek out links, connections or patterns between various facts and statements through discussion and analysis and consensus seeking. Students are instructed to assemble, group or categorize similar information into various clusters, thus promoting active learning. Question for discussion after our lecture. The method of mental maps. What is a timeline maker? Describe the fishbowl method. Define a Venn diagram. What is SWOT analysis? Ways to create a chart. And what is infographic? Here you can see the list of references that you can use after our lectures and practical lessons. Thank you for your attention.